Hey, Neil Smith here. In this video, we use Mercator sailing to solve for true course and distance to a destination, given the coordinates of the start point and the destination. Come on, let's get this. Mercator sailing practice problem eight. A vessel at latitude 21 degrees, 18.5 minutes north, longitude 157 degrees, 52.2 minutes west, heads for a destination at latitude 8 degrees, 53.0 minutes north, longitude 79 degrees, 31.0 minutes west. Determine the true course and the distance by Mercator sailing. So the first thing we'll do is find, find the difference between latitude 1 and latitude 2, which tells us how far north and south we've traveled. So little l is equal to latitude 1 minus latitude 2. So let's find little l. Lat 1 equals 21 degrees 18.5. 21 degrees 18.5 minutes north. Latitude 2 is equal to, whoa, one second here. Latitude one is equal to 21 degrees, 18.5 minutes north. Latitude two is equal to eight degrees, 53.0. 8 degrees, 53.0 degrees north. And so which way did we go? We need to understand which way we traveled north and south. We went from 21 to 8. We went south. So let's figure out the difference here. Okay, we're going this 18.5. We can't take 53 from there, so we'll borrow. And this will turn to a zero, and this will add 60. So this will be 78.5. Let's just put that in the calculator. 78.5 minus 53 equals 25.5. 25.5 degrees south. Remember, we said we went south. Okay, <clears throat> and now 20 minus 8 is 12. Yes. 12 degrees, 25.5 minutes south. And now we're going to turn these degrees into minutes as well. So we'll times it by 60. And 12 times 60. 12 times 60 is 720. 720, and then we'll add 25.5 minutes, and this will give us L. So L is equal to 7, 45.5 minutes south. Now we need to find M1 and M2. M1 is just the meridional parts of lat 1. So 21, 18.5. This is interesting because we have half a degree right here. So 21, 18.5. Here's our 21. We have minutes over here. 21, 12, 18. And we have to split the difference here. So there's 21, 18. There's 2119, the difference, it's 0.1 to 1.1 to 0.1, it's 0.55. So 1300.1 plus 0.55 will get us right where we want. 1300.1, 1300.1 plus 0.55 is going to get us to. M1 equal to 
hundred point six five. And now we need to find M2, which is going to equal the meridional parts of this eight degrees, 53 minutes. So we need to find eight degrees. Here's eight, 853. So we cruise down to 53 right here, and we get eight. This five comes down. So five. 31.6. 5, 31.6. 5, 31.6. Find the difference, and that difference between these is little m. So 13.65, 1300.65 minus 5, 31.6. 769.05 and now we'll find d low is the difference between longitude 1 and longitude 2 it it measures how far we traveled east and west so let's find d low with longitude 1 is equal to run eight longitude one one five seven fifty two point two one five seven fifty two point two minutes and that is west and then longitude two is equal to seventy nine thirty one seventy nine degrees 31.0 minutes west. And so let's see, which way did we travel? So 157 west to 79 west. 157 west is going to be like all the way over here. And we went to 79. So we actually went east. We went east in this problem. So... Two, this is an easy one. Two, two minus one is one. Five minus three is two. Twenty one point two minutes. And now let's do this one on the calculator. One five seven minus seven nine. Seventy eight degrees. Seventy eight degrees. 21.2 minutes east. Let's change these degrees to minutes because there's 60 minutes and one degree. So when we time 78 by 60, we get minutes. So 78 times 60. 7, 8 times 60 equals 4680. 46. 80 plus these 21.2 minutes will equal our d low. So d low equals 4,000. Now I'm going to put this in the calculator. 4680, 4680 plus 21.2 equals 4701.2. 4701.2 degrees east. That's our D low. So let's figure out our quadrantal notation, right? We got north, south, east, west, and our L, we went south. So we headed south and we headed to the east. So we're over here. Our course is going to be here. So our C, when we calculate C, C is going to be here. And when we calculate CN for the answer, CN is going to be from north. So from north to our course, this is going to be CN. So we're going to be south, course, east. So our CN is going to be equal to this 
180 minus C. 180 minus our course. So we'll figure out our course now so we can get the CN. Our course is equal to the tan negative 1 of D low over M. So we get tan negative 1. Our D low is 4701.2. Over M, which is 769.05. Whoops. Okay. Punch that in. Shift 10, negative 1, 4701.2. Or seven oh one point point two four seven oh one point two divided by seven six nine seven six nine point oh five equals eighty point seven one. So it equals eighty point seven. Seven one, we rounded there. So let's punch this in. This CN equals one eighty minus eighty point seven one. Say minus. Let's just do it. One eighty minus eighty point seven one. Eighty point seven one. 99.29 so cn equals 99.29 this should be one part of the answer now let's find distance distance is equal to little l over cosine of c our little l is up here 745.5 745.5 Cosine of 80.71. So our distance is equal to, punch this up, 745.5, 745.5 divided by cosine of 80.71. 80.71 is equal to 4618. 4618.01. And it's miles, and this is one of our answers. So let's see if if we got this. CN is 99.29. Okay, we got two 99s. It's one of these two. And our distance is 4618. 46. There we go, 46, 17.5. That's pretty close to 4018. I'm guessing A, because we got this, and we got really close here. 8 is A. Yeah, good. That's right, 8 is A. So that's Mercator Sailing Practice Problem 8.